what's going on guys back with another video team so wealthy you already know what's going on they say the sky's the limit but it ain't no limit for us you feel me like share comment subscribe and turn on post notification bell to get notified every time i drop another video you feel me and in this video right here i'm gonna be, I'm gonna be getting into a video where um we're on young thug in court and everything and doggone they going against witnesses or whatever like because some witnesses that they probably they probably not good witnesses or, or whatever the case is but <clears throat> We're gonna get into the video. Y'all let me know. Let's get it. Let's go. Uh, any argument on this particular uh, witness before I go ahead and uh, make a decision? Mr. Adams? Yes, sir. Just very briefly on behalf of Mr. Williams. Um, the issue before the court is whether or not uh, he should be qualified as, if, I, if I'm correct, I think the state is moving to qualify him as a forensic video um, analyst. Did I get that correct? Uh, yes, sir. Forensic video analysis. Analysis. Um, I would say to the court, Your Honor, based clearly upon the responses to the questions put for, put before this witness, um, and in consideration of the Daubert standard and Rule 702, uh, that this witness is clearly not qualified under that standard. Um, I would just state very, the, the court knows the law, so I will just say that under the uh, Daubert standard, uh, we look to what's relevant and rely relevance and reliability of the witness's testimony. Putting aside relevance, that's not really what we're talking about. We're talking about reliability of his of the technique of the um, uh, the, the proper testimony that would be offered. And although 702 and Daubert is somewhat flexible, um, it's geared towards scientific validity and the principles that that underlie a proposed submission. In this case, um, a video enhancement. Uh, we don't look towards the the conclusion. We look towards the uh, the principles and the methodology, and uh, we look towards whether or not there's been a testing of the experts, the, prefer the proffered experts theory, uh, there has not been. We look for whether or not there's been publication in support of the experts method or theory. Uh, there's no testimony that there has been any of that. We look towards, uh, the court is advised under Daubert to look towards. What about his education? Because that's that's kind of the, you know, the issue for me is so we want to talk about that or, or well, um, his experience. I should say he's been doing this thirty years. So um, education and experience is is uh, are factors that the court can look to as well. But um, and I heard the witness testify that he has um, testified in regards to video enhancements upwards of fifty times. Those fifty testimonies could all have been uh, improper. They could have been wrong because the methodology has to be tested. They could all very well have been done under the Harper standard, which is no longer the law in the state of Georgia. The question before the court is whether or not this witness um, meets the Daubert, uh, the Daubert requirements. And I would say to the court that simply looking at the responses to the questions, uh, both on direct and on cross, or on, on, on voir dire, uh, that he does not. That the the witnesses testified that there are no protocols uh, to the methodology used by him. Uh, he is un unable to indicate whether or not. But it's crazy to me, like, how many witnesses and how much stuff they got going on with this case because it's like, it's like, dog, it's like crazy how many witnesses, how much stuff they got going on with the case because they got so many people on the case. It's like 26, 28 people on the case, you feel what I'm saying? So, I mean, that leave a lot of area for people to start run their mouth and start doing certain stuff. You feel me? I, I believe like this case wouldn't be as bad and it could be over. I believe it could be it wouldn't be as bad if people wouldn't be as talking as much. You feel what I'm saying? If people wouldn't wouldn't be talking as much or whatever, I feel like it wouldn't be that bad. And if it weren't so many people on on the case, you feel me? Like like Boosie has said in that one black T V interview, you feel me, way before they even like like when the jump first had happened type jump like and people started getting snatched up you feel me like he was saying you put 20 some eggs in a basket you feel what i'm saying if you put 20 some eggs in a the basket then they gonna fold you feel me like somebody gonna end up folding up you feel what i'm saying and that's basically you know i'm like oh and they, they were right though because he like if you put 20 something you feel me you put them eggs in a basket you feel me Somebody gonna, one of them gonna crack, you feel me? One of them eggs gonna crack, you put them eggs in the basket, shake it up. One of the eggs gonna crack, you feel what I'm saying? And that was the, that was the jump. And it's like, dog, what? That's how this, how this shit going, but let's get back into it. 
his method or his methodology uh, is generally accepted. Um, uh, there is no peer review. It's not just that he doesn't know if there's any peer review. There is no peer review of his methodology. Uh, there is no testimony as to the error rate of uh, his methodology. And all of those, those factors, uh, he fails, or this witness fails uh, in terms of being able to be qualified as an expert. And I would ask the court to uh, deny the state's request to qualify this gentleman as an expert. All right. Anybody wish to add to Mr. Adams? I'm, what he is, don't, don't regurgitate, but just add if you've got anything to that. Uh, yes, Your Honor. Yes, Mr. Uh, Johnson. On behalf of Mr. Eppinger, All right. uh, Your Honor, the court pointed out the education and experience in this particular case. The witness testified that he had performed almost 500 of these video analysis over 30 years. That breaks down to less than two per month over the past 30 years. He also testified that he does not have any formal education or no continuing education with regards to these things over the past 30 years. Those are two things that he directly testified to. He has not shown that he has the requisite experience in this particular matter to be qualified as an expert, and as such, neither the education, Your Honor. So we believe that under Daubert, he should not be qualified as an expert. Thank you. All right. Anybody else? So basically, so basically, the, the witnesses or whatever they not they not really some of them not qualified witnesses. They you know they they testimony or whatever not reliable. I guess I don't know, but that I mean that's what comes with with people be witnesses and they be they be testifying and all this stuff like that's on crazy. And I mean I hope I hope the best for dude. I hope he make it up out the situation. You know. With, with diving, you know, to, to be on the other side, you feel me, and make it up about the situation for real. Like, that's all I can say. You know, it's like, oh, it's crazy. It's a it's a bad situation, man. It's a bad situation. And hopefully, dude can make it up out of there. Dude already got out, so he's straight. People people going to his neck and calling him all type of stuff. You feel me? So, I mean, I don't know. It's crazy. It's a crazy situation. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments and everything, you feel me? And I'll be back with another one, you feel me? You feel me? And boom. And if y'all if y'all got some videos that y'all want me to react to, any videos, like, send it to my Instagram, you feel what I'm saying? I need to start posting more on my Instagram and stuff, but send it, send it to my Instagram, like, DM me on Instagram or whatever the video, and I'll download or whatever, and I'll do a reaction for it, but just don't let me know like what the video about too much. Like, don't give me too much detail. Like, let it be a raw reaction because I don't like to watch the video before I react to it. I want to react to it with y'all. So, just let me know, shoot it to me, and I'll get back to you with another one. Nah, I'm out. Peace. <laughs>